unless we want to stream this, but I don't know. Twitch might yell at us. That's that's true. It's um clearly very offensive content. Well, because we would seduce the stream. It's true. Uh, and then all of the people in the chat would leave yeah. their wives. And th we don't want to be at fault for that. Yep, we're we are no home wreckers. However, we are here playing Super Seducer 2. This is a, a very special early beta code. This is advanced seduction techniques. Oh, I'm so excited. We received this from, of course, the seduction guru, Richard La Ruina. Yeah. Is that how you say it? Uh, yes, that is Spanish for dick ruin. Wow. Yep. Hey, did he tell you that? <laughs> yes. Uh, he's a very nice, polite gentleman. Mm -hmm. uh, I was seduced, of course. Yeah, but, naturally. I mean, he does that without trying. No, and I, I ho only hope I can gain some insight and some some skills from from the the dick wreck, right? Right. <laughs> yes, the dick wreck. Yeah. Uh, as as he's known. Yeah. Now, assuming I, that my dick won't be wrecked afterwards, right? <laughs> it is my dick that will be doing the wrecking. Uh, you know, it's it's just the noun form, just wreck. So we're oh, it's a, okay. maybe that's one of the techniques that we'll learn is is learning to direct and focus the wrecking energy where we choose to onto our dick, onto somebody else's dick. Yeah, I don't want self destructive dick wrecking energy because I've I've been down that hole before and it's very it's very poor. It's very poor. Yes, that's a poor hole. We're gonna try to go down the right. <laughs> <laughs> You so you played the first one. I I actually didn't get to play the first one. Okay. Well, we we did get two beta codes. So okay. if if you want to take this home and study more of the the advanced I, techniques, I might need to. Yeah. Just you know, a remedial course bring you up to speed. I did play, uh, I did play the first two missions. I think of the first one. Uh, this one missions. Yes, missions. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, but this one is more inclusive. Okay. Uh, it it. Uh, it spreads the dick energies out wider because in this one, uh, supposedly, there are two very special missions where you get to seduce a man. <gasps> no way! As a woman, no gay seduction. Uh, Only heterosexual uh, seduction here, I'm afraid. Uh, I, I think that's, I think the, the, the dude on dude seduction, I think that's covered in the 301 course. We're still at the 201 level here. It's, it's advanced, but it's not like master's level. Let's not get crazy. Okay. Well, I, I'll, I'll be waiting patiently for, for the new course. Okay. Well, let's, let's see what, what good old dick Hello, wreck. Here he is. Welcome to Super Seducer 2. We're back bigger oh and better. God. I listened to your feedback and we've made a number of improvements. The first thing is ethnic diversity. We've got Asian characters, black characters. Even a Scottish <laughs> guy. A Scottish guy. Finally. I also listened to female players feedback and now- <laughs> From, a chick's, from perspective. a chick's perspective. Finally, I'm joined by Charlotte. Hi everyone. To try. to try. Yeah, try. No promises. perspective on things. Hope you all enjoy the game. Press start. Okay. <laughs> let's, I can't wait. Let's get into our settings here. Okay, no subtitle option. Oh, uh, maybe they're automatically there. Who knows? Hey, it'd be nice. Uh, but this is a pre-release version, so okay. maybe that'll be implemented in the final version coming in... Coming tomorrow at the time of this recording. Okay, so... so they got one day <laughs> to get those subs in there. One day to get my dick on dick energy. Yes, so that we can all have subs together. If you're yeah. a sub, uh, hammer that like, share, favorite, subscribe. Yeah. And, and, and if, sub to us. If you're a dom, comment about the person below you. Yes. And how they are inferior. And right. And they will like it. Yeah, that, I mean, that's what they're into. Uh, uh, get their consent. Uh, make sure you have a safe word. Mm, okay, I guess so. Okay. Uh, my safe word slide whistle. Like the sound effect, like the. <laughs> the yes. The, 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 hang on. The. the yes, fucking. you need an actual slide whistle, okay. or I will not stop. Oh, do you come with one? Do you? Uh, do you? Hey, do you? Do you? Nope. Come, no, okay. No. Nope. No. 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 Don't. Don't walk that back. Okay. No, get, carry it forward. <laughs> yes. Do you ejaculate while playing the slide whistle? Yes. That's called uh, the moisty slide. Oh, the slip and slide. The we called it back in uh, back in Ohio. Yeah, that was an Ohio thing. Okay. Yeah. In yeah. in Hoboken, we called it the moisty slide. Uh, that's you know because you didn't have. 
you only had like dirt to play with back then. Exactly. Well, that's because we you, you took the moisty nap that they give you with your spork at, at the KFC, oh. and you use that to clean out the slide whistle afterwards. You, it's important to disinfect after every use. That's right. You don't want to spread seduction transmitted diseases, STDs. I've thankfully never gotten diagnosed with a seduction transmitted disease, but let's see if I can get one now. I've never been diagnosed with one either. I've also never been tested. So, hey. Oh, hey. Perfect score. Surprise for everyone. Yeah, it's... (laughs) <laughs> it's like a Wonder Ball. What's in what's in my Wonder Balls? Let's find out. Oh, it's, there's only one way to know, and that's to what? Uh, posh. I like how it says versus <laughs> posh totty versus, versus supermodel. I'm assuming we are the posh totty. Yeah, because that's that's easy mode. This You're... is like you know against Glass Joe right here. Okay, no, all right. Let's let's get in there. All right, we can we've explored zero percent. She just stepped off a yacht, but the supermodel is just too sexy. The choice is yours. Okay, so what's our goal here? We have we have a number, okay. sex, or kill your enemies. Okay, so that's three goals. Three is a number. First goal done. Okay. So two goals down, two, two goals left, sex or kill your enemies. I mean, it's an or. So we've already succeeded. We've got I, a I number. I think so. We have a we have a number. We have the number three. Yeah. So that's that's success. But let's try and hundred percent this. Let's try and get the other. So two this goals. has to either end with sex somewhere in this recording yes. or the death of someone. I mean, it says kill your enemies. Doesn't say kill just one enemy. So I, I'm willing to say if we don't kill all our enemies, then we failed the mission. Yes. So we not either need to kill all enemies, yeah. no one left standing, mm-hmm. or sex. The sex can be with anybody. It can be with an enemy, a friend. Does it? No, it's an Oxford comma there. Because I was going to say, can I, can I sex my enemies? But it is a sex or kill your enemies, like a whole thing. I mean, I, I would consider sexing your enemies to still be sex and therefore still a victory condition. Maybe the sex is so good and I kill them and I, and I get all three. I mean, we can only hope, but... Okay. I mean, that's that's why that's why we're in the advanced class. Uh, Dick this Rack. Is, this is what you get. He recognized greatness in us, and now it's Dick our recognized. job. Yep, Dick recognized Dick. Yeah. <laughs> and now it's our job to live up to his expectations. Let's do it. That's me. Yep. That's that's all of us right now. No, that that one's me. Oh, really? Yeah, but you know what? It's still only. Okay. Oh, no, okay. There we go. Now I'm the giant redwood. <laughs> <laughs> uh, someone got their Call of Duty in my super seducer. Well, he's ready to kill his enemies. Arthur, I'm hungry, man. Let's go to the restaurant. It's my kung fu. There better be an option to just fire a mortar shell at the party. I mean, look, why would kill your enemies be in the list of goals if we were not given the tools to do so? <laughs> Arthur. Arthur, worst wingman. Not a good cut. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey now. Now, I'm assuming the retail release will, in fact, come with a tank. Uh, we just got the steam code. So oh, that, yeah. yeah. We have a digital tank. Yeah. They, they they didn't want us to have to wait for shipping on the tank yeah. in order to share this seduction wisdom with you. Yeah. But that's the only reason. If you buy this from a brick and mortar store, I'm sure it has a tank. At least one. At least one. You you'll might have, need more than one. Yeah, you'll have to find the box. It'll, it's It's tough, though. Only one box has the tank in it. Right. It's it's like the golden ticket. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I want to you're I hope he's looking at the grandma. Yeah, uh, I mean, I'm assuming she she looks like the poshest toddy. <laughs> <laughs> and we're the supermodel, right. obviously. Clearly. That's why we can summon tanks. That's our superpower. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. 
how to approach capital A. That's jargon. That is super mm -hmm. seduction terminology. Okay, so the approach is step one. Yes. Uh, we could not approach and eat a kumquat. I mean, that's very that's very zen. Cum is in the name. Makes me think we might get sex right away. Mm, that's that's the speed run strat. Yeah. Uh, B, we can go and tell her that she caught your eye, and can you join her for a few mins? Mins, also jargon, that's short for minutes. Oh, okay. Okay. I thought that meant, you know, joining joining me at the ministry where we would pray to the Lord together and be chased. Right. See, that's good, good thought, good thinking, yeah. but in fact, short for minutes. All right, C, use the genius conversation starter from that YouTube guy. You know that YouTube guy? Oh, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the, with the Galaxy Brain conversation starters. Yeah, IQ yeah. 9000. Okay. Yeah, uh, no, he's, he's good. All right. We can gaze into her eyes whilst beckoning her, beckoning her with your finger as if it's a penis. Beckoning her with your finger as if it's a penis, implying I could beckon one with my penis. Is that like a curling motion? Can you do that? Uh, you know, I, I can't do that, but that might, again, that might be 301 level. Ah, okay. That might be post-grad. I don't know. I, I I feel like that one's a trap. That one's trying to get us to commit to a technique that's too advanced for us. I hear you have to graduate cum law to, to get that one. Uh, it's true. Yeah. <laughs> B, or E, rather, catch your attention non-verbally. Uh! <laughs> I want to know what that is. Okay, let's find out. <laughs> uh-huh. Yep. Non-verbally. Yep, no verbs. Nouns and adjectives only. What was that? What was that little, like, peace sign wave? Yeah. Hey, listen, I was just sitting there. Nope, saw. Saw is a verb. Saw you. And you caught my eye, so hi. I thought I'd come and say hi. How are you doing? Hi, I'm, I'm fine. That's good to hear. Coming for a spot of lunch. Ah, oh, lovely. Mm. Oh, yes. This is a nice way to start because if you catch her attention before you actually walk up, uh, she has a chance to kind of get used to the fact that you're going to be talking to her. And if you kind of just walk up and she hasn't noticed you, it's a bit of a surprise when you suddenly start talking. So it's a better way when you can do it. Yeah, I think it's also Oh, it's a little bit romantic. Just, just a little bit romantic, so... So I'm Richard. Hi, I'm Lottie. Ah, uh, Lottie, like Charlotte, yeah? Yes, it is. Ah, lovely yeah. to meet you. Good to meet you, too. Hello, I already... Okay, did. okay. This, this seems like the, the real hard part, because this is where she's gonna... This is our first decision we can make after approaching her. This is where she's gonna get a glimpse of our moral character. So the question is, is the waitress our enemy? Will we need to kill the waitress? Mm, I, I think that's indeterminate right now. We have to see how the waitress responds. Okay. So, uh, all right. Tell her not to bother you. You are in an, in an important conversation. I will have a piece of cake. The lady will be eating my dick. Now, this is... Okay, that's an advanced move. That seems like an advanced move. I don't know if I have enough uh, charisma to even do that right now. <laughs> Charisma is my dump stat. Oh, okay. I dumped it in the toilet this morning. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Uh, order a tea, cake, something for her. Okay. All right. So, like, here's the thing. Ordering for the lady, that's a mm. very, very smooth, very charismatic mm. move. Yeah. Uh, but you've got to know what she likes. And we haven't asked her if she likes dick yet. No. We can, we can assume, but she just got off the boat. That's and true. And I don't think we know anything else about her other than she likes not being on a boat. I mean, clearly she likes not being on a boat more than being on a boat. She might like being on the boat, too, but given the option, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. she's chosen to disembark. Okay, we can say, hey, babe, the usual, please. Okay. Uh, you know what? Everything on this menu sucks. Let's go back to my place. <clears throat> or, okay, slight variation on option C, order tea, cake, shot for confidence, something for her. Uh, that This seems like one of those real tricky, this seems like a trick answer. Like, this is on the SAT to throw you off kind of shit. Like, shot for confidence implies you didn't have it in the first place. That's true. Where we already have it. That's how we got here. Right? That's true. I mean, we we signaled to her without using verbs. If that's not confident, that, I don't know what is. I feel like that's that's the animal kingdom. 
walking up knowing this is my territory, this is my land. Right, I don't even have to pee on it to mark it, but I will anyway, because that's how confident I am. Okay, so ruling out shot for confidence. We're already confident. Mm -hmm. The usual please is a little presumptuous. This is our, our land. This is our marked territory, but I don't know if they know what we want right now. I mean... If, if she doesn't, then what is she doing here? Asking for death. It's true. Which makes her our enemy, which is one of our goals. I think that's... Uh-huh. I'll come here to use your face, though. How oh, for me, the usual, please, babe. Cherry cake. Uh, I mean, uh, cherry cake and uh, English breakfast tea with no milk. Like the, uh, the usual. And what would you like? Yes, I'd like the um, chocolate cheesecake and mm. a cup of tea. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I hate babe. I hate, I hate babe. babe. Do you like being called? I hate babe. I'm not even but babe, looking at oh. babe. So they hate babe. Sorry. Okay. So so we have gotten a. a a WhatsApp message. WhatsApp. WhatsApp, the popular text messaging platform. Uh, all, all the kids use it. <laughs> do you know that? I do know that. Okay, good. That is... <laughs> I didn't know how, how, you, how much you were into that. I actually, <laughs> you say all the kids use it, breaking character for a hot second. <laughs> I use it only okay. I use it only to speak to my one friend who is older than I am. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. That that oh, that makes me happy. Yep. Okay. Uh so I'm assuming that um uh, uh, Mahmoud Ma Mahmoud 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 is uh is Dick Rex one friend who's older than he is. Oh, okay. Um but we're kind of he knows we're busy. That's true. And we we said, "Hey, we're on a mission. I need to borrow the tank, Mahmoud." It's or actually, I, need to I don't need to borrow. It's my tank. It's true. I'm I'm informing you out of courtesy <laughs> that you will not be able to borrow my right. tank this yes. morning. So I'm busy. Do not bother me. And I would give no no condition otherwise. Yeah. Unless, what, my, what could it be? What my, my only consideration is that he, Mahmoud knows what we're all about here today. And he chose to interrupt us anyway. Does that make Ooh. him our enemy? And if so, which of these will get us closer to killing him? He would, he would, we could probably trace the call if we accept it. That's true. I think we have to. Okay. All the movies taught me that. That's true. All right. So we've got to keep him on the line until the call is traced. Yeah. That's our mission now. Lottie, I hate to do this, but I've got something really urgent. So it's lovely to meet you and all that, but I've got to go. Right. Um, Bye. <laughs> God, how rude. She just <laughs> breaks it. <laughs> I was really hoping to fancy a spot of dick this afternoon. Hey buddy, what's so urgent? There is a YouTube convention, my friend, and now is your chance. Ooh. Who's there exactly? The vice journalists. Great. Betty Jack. Awesome. Perfect. Boogie. Ah, he's quite like <laughs> Fucking prick. Alpha Rad. Friend without benefits. I like those guys too. That is also the mini mint. Nah, he didn't answer my email, so whatever. Anyone else? Bro, Jared? Let's fucking do this. Bring me my Lisa. What? Bring me my is that the one with the Batmobile in it? Or the one with the Iron Man suit in it? Uh, <laughs> excuse, I. I mean, you jest. <laughs> <laughs> But I, I think we're, we gotta fly to somewhere. I mean, look, Dark Horse answer. <gasps> what? Oh, yep. Now we're gonna kill our enemies. <laughs> <gasps> Die, did we? Fuckers. Are we going to bomb the YouTube convention? Oh my god, did we bomb YouTube Con? Well, we. I say we won. We killed our enemies. That was. I can't believe you predicted that. By the way, <laughs> look, <laughs> you have to you have to believe in the heart of the cards, and that's how you become a super seducer. I mean, you did pass uh, seduction one hundred and one. I I am just jumping into a one. I'm out of my league here, but man, you clearly knew what you were doing. Well, I mean, 
Do. <laughs> and that was only 2%. That was the wow. tip of the proverbial iceberg. Well, that's that's mission one in the bank. Uh, yeah, we won. We killed all our enemies. Yeah. Done. All right. Let's 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 see what chapter two. Uh, no verses this time. This is no. a co-op mission, boss and secretary. Oh, this this will be nice. Yeah. We work together. Yeah. It's, uh, all right. Co-op mission. Uh, it is dangerous territory, but the workplace is still a common place for relationships to begin. How do you successfully navigate and avoid getting fired or sent to jail? Ben, how do you avoid getting sent to jail? Uh, the the key is yeah. The key is to create a public persona for yourself that's like an old man who's from a different time, yeah. But he's still uh. kind of lovable, yeah. And then treat everything you do as a joke. Oh, so you can always like you can do something you actually mean and then laugh it off. Exactly. Okay, good. Yeah, and then no one will suspect and everybody will go, oh, silly old <laughs> oh, Ben. Oh him. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he put that in, in her drink as a goof. <laughs> <laughs> That's so classic Ben. He did that, he did that a few years ago. <laughs> oh, and now she's pregnant with an irony baby. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so good. Uh, but neither neither goof drinks nor irony babies are our goal today. No. Today our goal is is simply a date. Just a date. Yeah. That's, that's all. That's that's baby mode. That's yeah. irony baby mode. Uh, you know what? Sometimes you've got to get in your rep your reps with the basics before you can step up to the advanced. So I think I think okay. it's good that we're we're getting a little refresher course here. Yeah. Kill your enemies, date your secretary. That's I, that's a solid day. I yep, that's what I woke up today. That was my to-do list. And we're already halfway there. I'm I can't wait to see how the secretary datery goes. All right, let's do it. I think a little bit. I think a little bit. A little bit got some sinus problems. Sorry. How's your business going? It's going really well. Yeah. We're doing uh, product design now, really? furniture design. This oh, is an ad, yeah, right? It got two prototypes and they seem to be really nice. Oh, Everybody brilliant. likes them. But more importantly, how many followers you got on your honestly designed Instagram? So, so is this our barefoot important. secretary oh, in our really? living room? No, I think this is irrelevant. Okay. At the moment, but I that's hope we get well, more. clearly that's not true because everything is relevant. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. In this teaching tool. Office, but you know, I just noticed that skip button, but. It's, a, it's tempting me. It was me. really nice party. Hmm. Mm. Sorry I wasn't there, but, but it's not all bad because I've got a present for you. You do? Yeah. Please. You ready? I think so. Well, okay, this... I don't... I think this is just uh, our, our our side quest. Okay. For the day. All right, well, let's let's... Do our side quest here so we can give her, for her birthday, it is her birthday, uh, Lilia here, uh -huh. a a raccoon. It does not say live or stuffed. I'm going to presume live. Probably. If somebody says, hey, would you like a raccoon? I'm assuming live until told differently. Yeah. Voucher for yoga lessons. Is that, are we, see that, that's a very, that's a very bold move because we're either saying the ass is not fat enough or I have noticed your ass enough to know that you do yoga Please continue doing it for me and you. Right, but because I'm paying for it, now it's it's my yoga. Now it's now it's my yoga, and my ass. Yes, therefore my ass. Okay. Or gift a game on Steam. That's you know what? She mentioned Instagram. Clearly hip with the electronics. True. Might own a computer. Potentially. Lowercase Steam. Maybe it's mm. just. Maybe it's just a, a a game with with much vapor. I mean, maybe it's literal steam. Maybe it's it's just water vapor. That that her gift could be a hot air balloon. <gasps> that that sounds really fun. That I sounds would, really cute. I would love a hot air balloon. I'm sure she would too. Let's give her a hot air okay, balloon. Okay, let's give her a hot air balloon. Okay. Let, you've been wasting a lot of time with this uh, design business, so I've got your present. Now, this is a gift and you've a challenge. A I would like to race you now. around the world. <laughs> yeah, and I've gifted you this game. Check it out. Mm. So basically, you're a dick, balls, and an asshole, and you need to take your dick <laughs> and fuck the other asshole. It's called genital oh, jousting. Mm. Yeah. I thought it's your kind of thing, because you like... Mm. Yeah? You like it? Because I like yeah. Things, yeah. yeah. Clearly. Well, who doesn't, right? Mm. Mm. I don't think I understand it. So, how am I supposed to? 
Well, you control the dick, you know, you go around, you get to the arsehole, fuck the arsehole. The other guy's trying to do it to you and, you know, you can play multiplayer mm. and all that. Very exciting, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Very intellectual as well. I think my design is interesting. Couldn't you do some design, interior design? Well, I mean, this one has yeah. has a dick and balls, though. Did General yeah, Jousting come out the same good. week as this? <laughs> I like this one too. Do you like it? Give him computer game. Give on him Steam. a computer game. Mm -hmm. I mean, she might love computer games. I could be wrong. She could love them, in which case, it's a great gift. Mm -hmm. Well, well, she doesn't. A, well, then it's not a good gift. Okay, if so like well, if she, she likes the gift, like this is then too advanced. I can't. I think you're kind of. No, it's still not very good. Very selfish present. Okay, what if it's my game and you gift it this holiday season? What if she doesn't have something to play out on? What if it's my game? Right, then she would learn how to seduce yeah. men. Oh, it's the best present ever. <laughs> I love him. Yeah. <laughs> This is great, you know, and I'm happy we can still be friends after, um, you know, <laughs> when we had sex. Yeah? yeah. Do you remember? Yeah, yeah. that time, yeah. like in my house, and we had some drinks, and yeah. when you just broke up. And... <laughs> <laughs> you remember? I yeah. love yeah. this. Yeah. Uh, uh, anyway, look, guess what? Um, <gasps> oh, okay. Is, uh, so this oh, is shit. Bro. This is a big day, yeah. Oh. Yeah. She good. Oh, she's really smart. I think she's gonna be great. Yeah. Oh, hope so. Hope mm -hmm. she can work it out. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and then I have that picture of myself yep. at my desk, tenting my fingers. <laughs> Do you like camping? Because this is the tent that we're going to have sex in. <laughs> Sarah, could you come in, please? Is there a picture of himself doing the fingers in the photo of himself doing the fingers? I I mean, there is a picture behind him there. Yeah. Okay, well, it's your first day at work, so we should get you started with something. <laughs> or maybe something hard. very hard. Let me ask you to... Okay. First task for your new secretary will be... <sighs> tell her you can't focus on work because you are thinking about fucking her. That seems like a, a good Ben joke. Create a situation... <laughs> in a <laughs> no, it's true. That's that again, leaning into our persona as yeah. as a person who's just the, the worst. But ha ha, just kidding. But ha ha ha. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Create a situation in order to surreptitiously check out her ass. Mm, little incognito, not bad. I, I mean, it didn't say anything about this being a stealth mission. That's true, but I'm saying that it's good to gather some info before you try to get the date. We got to know a bit more, like how fat is the ass, before I even know how close to get to it. I mean, is it is it meta knowledge to say that I don't believe Dick Wreck would have put us in a room with a woman mm. with a substandard ass? Mm. No, I think I think I think that's just playing the field. You know what you're doing. We could sexily show her how to staple properly. I don't even know how to sexually staple properly, so I feel like that would be good for me. Not even just for her, but I want to know how to arouse potentially myself by stapling. That's that's true. I've aroused myself many ways, and I've stapled many things, but I never thought about combining the two. At least not in the office. I'm clearly losing something in life. We could ask her to fax some contracts and rearrange a meeting. Little, little dry. Little dry. Little dry, but sometimes you, you've, you've got to start dry. Yeah. Yeah, sometimes you've got to go in dry. It's the only way. Well, you're never going to know if you're good enough unless you go in dry and come out come out wet, you know? Yeah, that's that's what the slide whistle method is all about. The slip and slide! <laughs> the slip and slide, yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, or she could just take our dirty laundry to the dry cleaners. I I feel like that's... That's uh, not very... Speaking as someone who managed a dry cleaner for a couple of years, uh, they're the worst, they're bad for the environment, uh -huh. they're overpriced, and I yeah. hate them. But was there any... There, there's no punchline to that. That's just my real experience from doing that. It sucked. Don't use dry cleaners. Sorry, go ahead. <laughs> but was there any sex? That may well have been... The time in my adult life with the least sex. Really? Yes. 
Oh, believe then, it or not, I know all of you at home are thinking, oh man, those dry yeah, cleaning, the dry managers, cleaning days. Yeah. Yeah. That's that's what I want to do. Fuck YouTubing. Fuck Twitch. Uh, uh, fuck my rap career and my mixtape. I want to be getting that dry cleaning pussy. Turns out, not so much. Where's your mixtape? I, I left it in my car. Okay. Yeah, in in my tape deck that I still have in my car in the year 2018. <laughs> I'm from a different time. Yeah, that, Don't uh, be ha, offended ha. by anything I do. <laughs> Let's sexily show her how to staple yeah, properly. <laughs> So far, so good, but I've noticed one big problem. So we need to fix it. You're not Do you know what it stapling is? sexily <laughs> what enough. What is that drawer in his desk? Stapling. It's where he keeps yep. all his staplers. It's just not gonna cut it. So how are we gonna do this? Okay, give me a hand. Not using the red office space stapler, oh, that's yeah, a little try yeah. hard. Oh, here okay. we go. So it's all in the way you touch it. Have <gasps> a grip with your little finger here. Like and imagine that. that's my scrotum and my taint, and then... Ah, uh, scrotum and taint only, please. <laughs> if you touch the shaft, you're fired. Uh, let me try. Okay. Yeah, try. Give me a hand. <gasps> Do that. Ambulance. Ambulance. Oh, is this all part of the... Call an ambulance. Ow! <laughs> Ooh, still got the scar from that one. Uh, that was dessert. Wrong answer. Bodily injury, we have learned a violent attack yeah. is a morally acceptable response yes. to a bad come on. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we know now that we know what the dangers are. We could put this is we could die here. Yeah, I mean, there's nothing stopping her from stapling our jugular to our balls, and there, those are not meant to staple that no. way. No, absolutely medical science. not. But <laughs> she would find a way because this is this is you gotta have Look, you gotta commend this guy. He's putting his neck and his dick out there for he, your entertainment. You know what? Let's commend her too because we were presumptuous. We assumed that she needed our help to learn how to staple properly, but that was excellent technique. That was. Now the choice of our flesh as as a medium for the stapling, mm, no, uh, unconventional, yeah. but I'm not going to call it wrong. She clearly knows her business. She's a strong independent woman who don't need no man to teach her how to staple. That's right. So, all right. If she doesn't, if she's a strong, independent woman, then I feel like she. we could just make a situation to check out the ass, right? I'm, because she's going to want to do her own thing. Like, no, I don't need you. I can do it on my own. Where we, as the male gaze, mm -hmm. will assume the uh, patriarchy. Uh, the, no, the male gaze are in the 301 course where we, where we <laughs> learn guy on guy seduction. I'm sorry. Okay. Well, then I guess pick number one. Okay. Letter one. All right, letter one. Sarah, we're gonna have problems, you know, because Sarah, we're gonna have problems, you know, because you haven't been here long, right? Not long at all. But I can't do any work because I'm just looking at you and I'm just thinking of <laughs> fucking you. Bending yeah, boom, 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 boom. No boom, fun boom. for anyone. You know, what are we gonna do about it? Can you say it one more time? She's got a tape recorder. So. Oh yeah. no! All right, well. You're very distracting, <gasps> very beautiful, and I'm just sitting here fantasizing. Oh no, I see it. Fucking you here, fucking you there on my couch, fucking you, and all these losers go home. Okay, th that's enough. I am sending this to everyone. Well, no, wait, 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 wait. You are gonna be fired for joking, that. Joking, joking, everyone. <laughs> it's a April Fool's Day in June. Almost got him. Uh, almost. Almost got him with the joke card. Yep, that was narrow, narrowly. <laughs> Bad one, huh? Totally a bad one. Really I can't believe we got shot right there. Well, I mean, we've learned uh, that's why it's important to test out these skills in a safe environment. Mm, yeah. Such as a, a hot air balloon from uh, brought to you by Steam. Yeah, yeah. A safe space, as yeah. it as it were. This game is my safe space. It's true. I feel safe. I feel so safe that 
I, I want to talk to her about my dirty laundry. Oh, uh, are you sure about we're, that? We're going to open right up, just let out all the dirty laundry. I know they appreciate honesty. Yeah. They being all women. Yes, all women everywhere, because a woman once told me that, mm -hmm. and as a woman, she is entitled to speak for all other yeah, women. Yeah, she is the queen of women. Yes. Got some stuff lying over there. Um, suit carrier, there's uh, a few suits, shirts, different things. They've just been lying there for weeks waiting for something. You know, I'm so busy. But uh, do you think you could just take them and run to the dry cleaners and, and sort that out? Thank you. Yeah. Great. Thanks very much. Just the normal service, whatever, you know, not extra starch or all that rubbish they tried to sell. Thank you. That one. Yeah, I need that. Now he did. So that was a that was a double dip. He was able to surreptitious surreptitiously check out her ass. I did notice that's that at the end. That's not her job, surely, in her job description to do her personal laundry. In my experience, I think that if someone's uh, working with you, in the beginning, they could do, you know, less personal things like that. But by the end, you can be saying, you know, can you run that down to the shop? Can you do that? As I suppose long as... it's the job description, yeah. whatever that is. But yeah, maybe at the beginning. Too oh, she's only on the second day in the job? Mm, okay. Okay. Mr. Lorena, I've got a lot of mail today. What should I do with it? <laughs> I'm, hold on, I'm thinking. <laughs> Correct tone. Correct tone to take with her, okay. Flirty and cheeky to plant the seed of a relationship. I'm all about planting my seeds. I, I am too, but remember, we're only looking for a date here, not a relationship. That, oh, that feels I didn't like too even, much too soon. I didn't even think of that. I'm thinking with my tiny brain. I mean, do dates grow from seeds? Or shit. <sighs> shit. I didn't know this was going to cover plant biology. I is a date a vegetable? I I'm, I'm going to say ye yes. I think so. Is it a grain? Oh my god, I don't remember what it is. <sighs> okay, you know what? Maybe we should avoid that one until we've yeah. leveled up our botany. Uh professional because it's an office. That seems like the obvious answer. Like the C rank student would pick that. It's it's true. You know, you you don't stand out in a crowd unless you take off your pants. If it's a crowd of pants wearing people. But if everyone has their pants on, then you put pants on and then take them off. But if everyone has pants off, then you buy everyone pants and then you're the guy with Ooh, all the pants. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I see. <laughs> Letter C. Letter C. Sexual because it's your company and you can do what you want. It now, Ben. <laughs> <laughs> you could invoke this at any moment, and we could we'd have nothing to say. That's true, but I, I feel like that's a card that's more powerful the longer you keep it in the deck. And the, the the threat mm, in the dick of yep the threat of your dick is perhaps more potent than your actual dick. Threat of dick in the deck. Yes, a dick decking. Mm. Don't deck your dick. Choose B. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you need to get used to that because we get a lot of mail. Most of it is junk, right? But don't throw it out right away. Why don't we start like this? Make uh, two piles. Right. For the first couple weeks, we'll try and figure it out. And, you know, slowly we'll get to the point so that you're just opening everything and only bringing me the important stuff. But for now, you know, try and separate into two piles and we'll, we'll see how it goes. OK, got we it. got a smile there. Okay, cheers. She's like, OK. This is a pretty obvious one. <sighs> you were right. It's right? too obvious. Yeah, of course. Um, again, like it's the beginning. So you know how you're not comfortable when you just start a new job and the last thing you want is you know the difficulty of dealing with uh, mm, okay okay at that time as well i just think you'll instantly lose respect for him if he starts okay but that seemed to be going okay though okay mr lorena yeah what's going on i have thomas green on the phone for you no wait wait hey hey thomas how you doing buddy no, 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 that's just rumors started by short sellers. You know, what? Guys who are pushing down the share price. 3,000%. <laughs> uh, no, 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 we only raised the price on that. Is she doing the mail? Is this some separate thing? I... 
hundred and something. Is she listening in on our phone call? Is that is she taking notes? Really What's happening? We can, you know, do better R and D and create more life saving drugs. No, uh, fake news. Look, that's fake news. I, I've got to go. I'm sorry, I've got a meeting. Yes, yes, I understand. Another time, another time. Thank you very much for your call. Bye bye, bye bye, bye. Sarah. Sarah. Uh oh. Are, are we going to have to discipline her? <laughs> Is it time for some, some reprimands? I mean, she knows the safe word. That was in the orientation packet. So if we go too far, that's on her. Because she didn't use the safe word. Now, Sarah, you didn't pull out your slide whistle. All right. We can tell her it's not a big problem, but be more careful in the future. Mm. Tell her it's totally fine. No biggie. No biggie's a little too, is not boss-like. It's true. And also, he called her into his office. That's not what you do for a no biggie. Yeah. Clearly, there is a biggie in his office somewhere. Mm -hmm. Uh, I can make her cry to teach her a lesson. That's just no. That that feels like that's that's a third date. <laughs> <laughs> at the earliest. Yes. Or tell her to book a hotel for you both at lunchtime to make it up to you. She needs to be informed of what this problem is, but however, should it repeat, that's when we bring out the D. Okay, so that, that sounds like an A then. Yeah, I think so. All right. Sarah, do you know what you just did? Yeah? This guy, Thomas Green, is a real asshole. Okay, so he's on the list. You've got it there somewhere in your desk, right? You know that one? 20 people not to put through? Now, now right, 17 of them are dead because of the previous mission, but there's three left. Sarah. It's all right. But in future, just, you know, your job is basically to protect me from all these nasty people. My mum put them through straight away. Certain people put them through straight away. Thomas Green. Sorry, he's busy. He's always busy. He's in a meeting. He's out. That kind of thing, right? But don't worry too much. Just, you know, be careful. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to do that. That's I'll be right. more careful in the future. Okay. Don't worry about it. All right. Workday's going okay so far, right. I think. That's the right option, you know, in, uh, in any kind of um, office environment, if someone's working for you, you want to give them a chance. So that, if they make that woman with, the, mistake, with her propping herself up with her arm in the corner show. there, yes. she's, she's had to sit here this whole time. Yeah, again, it's true. Like that, holding the, the bottle or the fucking glass of Chardonnay. Right, that's because she, she already got the one warning and then she screwed up again and this is her punishment. Oh, okay. Mr. Lorena. But I didn't realize I would also be learning boss techniques. That remember when I, I, I know, yeah. re remember when I made you cry on your second day? I yeah. I, you know what? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That was that was my beat. It's useless. It turns out. And the last one is with Phil Beckman. Okay. Now you know I told you about Phil, right? He's very very important. He's invested even more money. He's up to. See, but but now now I've made you cry tears of joy. The little biscuit. On your third day. Your third day here right that's yeah. I got, okay and that's when we go out on a date do you want to go out on a date with me kieran okay okay right after this okay we've still got it we've still got to fuck this nicely okay i okay. thought we were going on a date with her okay no she can come too okay three person date okay okay all right we can tell her to wear more sexy clothes to work now she's already wearing sexy mm, clothes i feel like that's she's wearing pretty sexy clothes but she needs to wear more of them uh, just like layers, just la yeah, layers, okay. each more sexy than the last. Yeah. Yeah. Or tell her some juicy gossip about the marketing director. That's that's definitely like, you know, third week kind of thing. Yeah. Give her a personal task to perform for you and reveal some personal info. Or tell her you had a really sexy dream about her and describe it in graphic detail. I, you know, this, this D started out strong. Uh, yeah. But I think you want to leave something to the imagination. You want to just leave it at, so I had this really sexy dream last night. So about paperwork. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And then when she's doing the paperwork. Yeah, she'll be like, what was the, what was the sexy dream though? Was it in my ass? I but, don't know. <laughs> I think. So, okay. So D's out. 
B's out. B's yeah. B's. I like the Laird option for A because winter's uh, winter is coming. Yep. Uh, Into a slide whistle. Yeah. And <laughs> and I I feel like we're just looking out for her to put on some more sexy clothes because I like the sexy clothes, but more of them. Yeah. Will keep you keep you warm. Yeah. What you're doing is great. Now up it by like half again. Yeah. Okay. That's that's positive reinforcement. Yeah. You've been working here for a while now, Sarah. And I've noticed something, it's a little bit personal, but basically these outfits you're wearing, they're not really working, okay? You look like a cross between Hillary Clinton and that Angela Merkel German one, you know? So we're gonna have to sort this out. I need you to take the skirt up quite a lot, you know? I need just a little bit of- Just a little bit, just a tiny bit. And I don't know what to do upstairs. I mean, you've got some boobs, right? Push up bra, low cut top, boom. There we go. All right. You can have a budget from the company to go shopping. You know what? Yeah. You have to send an official request to the HR department first. HR <laughs> department. Okay. It's my company. I'll tell them See, right now. See, she thought she had us Sarah, there, but it turns out the Fuck H- you, bitch. HR. The HR company works for us. It's my company. Sally. Sally, get in here. The Sally. <laughs> I like the red lights this for the could be bad a choices. With, uh, HR and maybe. Um... Yeah, I'd be on the phone to HR. <laughs> could it escalate, right? <laughs> Definitely, and it's not going to. So, should you fail, we will have to shoe shine a gunman. Yes. I think it's C. I think it's C as well. Sarah, you know my mum calls all the time, right? Yeah. So you know we're pretty close. Oh, she's so a happy. Birthday coming up. Really? I love birthdays. Yeah, yeah, so I wanted to ask for your help. Um, Fun fact, all women have birthdays. Something, obviously, you know, we can buy her something extravagant. I didn't even think about that. She really right? likes it when I'm thoughtful and, you know, like you know people. me better by now. So yeah. could you just That's the think funniest a little thing you've bit said and see if you have any ideas and then we can have a little brainstorm, you know. Look, I mean, it's yeah. just like, it's a simile, it's not the literal. Oh, yeah, yeah. All right, thank you very much. That's right. So it's already been a little while. So revealing a little bit of personal information it's at this cool. time is cool. And it's, uh, it's not super personal. It's just the right amount of personal. Yeah, and you're not re- you're, you're seeing how she acts. What are those guys on the right talking about? about her choosing what are those two talking about, about during this whole time? Yeah, yeah, you can. You can That's what I want to know. About her character I mean, are they like a separate study group? <laughs> Good morning, Sarah. <gasps> Ooh. Oh, call me Richard. Okay. okay. All right. Now, interesting. Talk, not ask, because you already know. Talk about how her weekend was. Oh. Uh, that, okay. That from the the uh, spy cameras in her apartment, of course. Naturally, we got. We I think we upgraded that tree off camera. Right. Complain that you had to work over the weekend to get sympathy. Mm. Yeah, that that feels like a bitch move. Yeah. Uh, Ask when was the last time she had a proper seeing to in the bedroom. That's that's a little forward for right now, I think. Now, if this was if now the lady from the little preview mission, she Uh was all about the interior design. And she would probably like her bedroom. Oh, she would. But this is, in fact, a different woman. Oh shit! Are they? Yeah, I mean these two. There's there's like four or five kinds out there. What? So, okay. So or D. Shit. Talk about a girl you fucked over the weekend with explicit detail. Now again, it's it's the explicit detail that's I, I getting th- me. Yeah, I have something to do with it. I th- I think it's A. I th- I think it's A. I think we need to impress her with our knowledge about her weekend. That sounds good. Okay. How was your weekend? It was fun. Um, I went to go karting with oh, yeah? my friends. Yeah, it was I'm surprised. So much fun. Yeah, you like racing and stuff. Yeah, I do. Actually, mm. driving is my passion. Well, I didn't know that. Yeah. And how was your weekend? Oh, it was good. I had to finish some work and then just yeah, relax, watch the movie, and uh, it was pretty good. I'm, I feel rested, but I didn't know we had a speed freak in the office. Well, now you know. Uh-oh. Oh, did you see that? Mm. 
She she likes uh, being like called a freak of, of any plastic. nature, mm -hmm. but speed yeah, especially yeah. being her drug of choice. Uh, personal, but for a Monday morning in an office, it's uh, it's definitely okay. Um, but it might reveal something that you know is uh, is interesting and tells you more about her yeah. outside the office. Maybe you have some common ground somewhere, something you share in common that you can talk about. Sarah, how long have you been working for us? Now? Okay, so you okay. were right. Three weeks. Three weeks. Yeah, is, yeah, about yeah. Three mm -hmm. weeks, right? That's how long it Look, takes. I think you're doing great so far. You know, okay. everything's cool, pretty much. And uh, I just obviously, to you and I got a date in three days, in but that's because we're in the career, advanced like class. What, yeah, yeah. I want to develop. Well, my main goal is to learn and develop, and mm -hmm. I want to get as much knowledge as possible in all areas of the business. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'm very happy. Okay, she, right. she wants as much knowledge as possible. All areas. Okay, so we can tell her that the working world is really for men and that she should be focused on finding a husband. Mm. Now again, we're just looking for a date. That's, that's some life advice. Yeah. Uh, we can tell her she needs to set her sights lower. All right. Uh, tell her that she gets an A plus for filing and an F minus for sucking your dick. I feel like that's discouraging. You want to, this is what we were just talking about, positive reinforcement. Yeah. At least a C minus. See, I think you don't, I think you don't put a grade on it the first time. I think. Mm, okay. Okay. I, I, I think maybe a needs improvement, but, but letter grades, but, those, those are old world education. But she'll at least get the report card that says plays well with others. Right. And clearly. like, so it doesn't matter what you get. Cause you got that one. Yeah. And the parents are like, oh good. I don't have that messed up of a child. Yeah. He's, uh, he hasn't killed all his enemies yet. Yeah. Not yet. Yeah. So technically he's a failure, but I don't tell him that yet. I, I mean, look, everybody's a failure when they're three. <laughs> <laughs> or we could give her career advice and mentor her. If I know anything about mentorships. It's that the Greeks fucked all the boys. That's true. So I think that's a that's a a slight, slightly easier way in because the mentorship can easily turn into a dominant relationship. Right. And she will have to come to us looking for advice because we know more. And she is a lowly dum dum. She is a lowly dum dum. Okay. I'm I'm with you. Let's go yeah. D. Sarah, you know what? Um, the person that had your job before you, they're actually doing really well now in another business. So there are lots of opportunities. I, I didn't know you had that kind of ambition, but here's what I can do. You know, we've got all the different departments here, everything from IT to marketing to the research and development guys. So why don't I invite you to more meetings, more events? And that way you're just going to learn about all the different sides of the business and we can see what you like, see how things go. And yeah, maybe maybe we can find something better for you in the future. How does that sound? Really good. Okay, Thank so now you. we've okay. created an expectation mm -hmm. uh, that that we're offering her That's basically right a promotion. And, yeah, and, yeah. And then she'll become wet with gratitude and sleep with us. And Ooh! Experience and, you know, maybe in a, in a good job or just have some amount of knowledge. Uh, demonstrating that is always attractive, I would say. Yes, it shows that he's ambitious and he's also ambitious for her as well. <laughs> I like him looking through the glass Sorry, wall. Yeah. Yes, Richard? Okay, ask where she is <laughs> wearing right now. <laughs> Jerk off while on the phone to her. Well, toward her. So yeah. So are are we like making it very obvious that this this motion is towards you? Uh, Bill has the best view, but this is towards you. Uh, yeah, we're orienting <laughs> everything involved in yeah. this. The, the the phone, the penis, everything. Dude, you want to put my dick on the phone? Just give it a little. Yeah. Just just want to listen to that. Yeah. Uh, or we could invite her to a fancy business networking evening event. Tomorrow. That's four adjectives. That's a lot of adjectives. That's very strong. That's very nonverbal. No verbs. The one verb versus there's a four to one adjective to verb ratio. That's a strong move. Let's do it. Sarah, are you free tomorrow? There's this brilliant networking event. Sarah, are you free tomorrow? There's this brilliant networking event. We've got a lot of industry big wigs there. It's gonna be super, super cool. Do you want to yeah. come? Yeah, of course. Thank you for the opportunity. Anytime. Okay, great. 
What was that? So this is cool because it's kind of um, blurring the line a little bit between office and social. And you could do it with uh, after work drinks or you could do it with a team building event or uh, a business trip, but a networking event would be another option. But it still keeps it unprofessional. So is that what all these team case. building exercises have been for, Ben? Oh yeah, everybody's getting laid. Have you not? No. I, Kieran, I am so sorry. I am I not am I not good enough? No, Kieran, again, this is the buck stops what, here. This what, is on me. What? Okay, I clearly okay. haven't been mentoring you hard enough. Yeah. And we're gonna fix this, okay? Okay. Okay, next team building exercise. Yeah. Nobody gets laid but you. Oh. <laughs> okay. 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 All right. First first we've gotta complete this mission. Gotta get we're we're <sighs> Minimum three weeks in. Okay. We're going to get that date. All right. How do we behave at the networking event? Be slightly flirty. Play it cool when there. How we play it before, how we play it after, up in the mm -hmm. air. But when there, when play there. it cool. Okay. Or get drunk and make a move. Uh, here's the only... She's a speed freak. That's true. Three weeks is a long time. That's true. We might have lost our chance already. <sighs> Yeah, I, I think we, nope. I mean, cool is too slow. S slightly flirty is too slow. We need to make a move. I think we need to go now. Yep. Yeah. Gotta go fast. One week. Yeah. It's been four weeks. That's a, that's a whole month. So, you went to the event with Mr. Larina? Yeah. So, you went to the event with Mr. Larina? Yeah, I did. Did anything happen? Oh, it was a disaster. He started touching me and it was so awkward. Oh, what a creep. Yeah. So? So our, our options have been shuffled now. So now I think it's... Be slightly flirty? We can't play it cool. It's been way too long. It's ice cold. Well... What's cooler than being cool? Slightly, slightly flirty. flirty. It's true. So it's the first time out of the office, slightly flirty. You could go both ways, really. A bit risky, maybe. Yeah, That's maybe not what I'm in for. Yep. Longevity, but then I don't know. It just depends on the woman, maybe. It's also that it's the first time, yeah. right? So to kind of get through that in a professional way is. I, I think it's a big best. tick. If you can do that. One week later. All right. Okay. Where are we at the one month mark? So you went to the event with Mr. Larina. So you went to the event with Mr. Larina? Yes, I did. Did anything happen? Um, no, it was fine. Uh, he was kind of flirting, but I guess that was just the drinks. <sighs> he probably drinks too much. Yeah, maybe. Okay, marketing team. It's the weekly strategy meeting. I want to get it kicked not off. Not a slightly in a great, great way. way. Yeah. So, he's not even who logged has in. a fantastic idea. Mr. Laruina. Gerald, okay. I've got one. I've been working on a proposal to increase our Facebook and Instagram likes. I have a three posts a day. We define the quotes, health tips, and picture of the people with the season. I'm sorry, you're speaking German? Um, we think. It'll get good traction in the social media, so we'll gain a lot of shares. Okay, share, like, like favorite, likes. subscribe. Uh -huh. I'll send some concepts. Uh, what do you think about this idea? Uh, it's about going to be cost of about fifteen thousand dollars per month budget to get up to hundred thousand followers within six months. <laughs> okay, give him a big slap and fire him. That I, that's, is a very dominant move. I, that's already where I'm leading. Uh, uh, agree with the guy because your secretary agrees. Mm. Doesn't feel very dominant. Uh, wank, masturbate. masturbate. Okay, thank, th yeah, thank, thank you. you. Uh, it's, again, I didn't advanced know that. jargon. I just just showed up here. Uh, uh, into the plant pot. Uh, humiliate the guy for his stupid idea. Okay, so we're not firing him yet. We're giving him, like we say, everyone deserves a second chance, but he clearly he needs to be humiliated minimum. 
Hmm. Or we could smartly persuade everyone to your view. Everyone includes the secretary. That's true. Why wouldn't you pick that? You know what? Once once she's used to being persuaded, it's it's like breaking a horse. It is like breaking a horse. That's it. That's that's, that's the, the end. Of the, yeah, that's, that's the, the end, end of the analogy. All right, let's do it. <laughs> <laughs> Gerald, I like the direction, but I've got something that I need. All of you. All of you need to pay attention to this. Anytime you present me with a spending plan, I need to know how that backs out in terms of revenue. I'm not going to spend 15000 a month unless it makes at least 15001 okay? So we need that in all of our plans. Do you know how much a like is worth? If you don't, you've got to find out. If you can't tell me, we don't do it, all right? Now, maybe you want to do something more targeted. Maybe ah, you want to target that ass FDA officials. officials oh, on Facebook. I didn't Facebook. even think about that. Maybe you want to target people with specific diseases on Facebook. Now, that's a good idea. All right, guys. So uh, Preferably something that. that's Anyone stupid, please. Something that we can use? So, yeah, you're using the knowledge again in an attractive way. And... Uh, it's also important for someone in power not to kind of exercise that power at any given opportunity by crushing, <sighs> killing and destroying people. It's nice to, to do it in the right way. And uh, yeah, I think it's attractive. But it's attractive, though. OK. Like, uh... Morning. Hey, morning. Morning. How you doing? Good, and you? Oh, I'm all right. I'm a little bit embarrassed, though, that um, I've got a massive wine stain on, on my shirt. It's a disaster. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't exactly my fault. It was busy, but we don't need so that. So I'm just going to take off my shirt just, uh, <laughs> right now. Never a good look. Do you think they'll be able to get it out of the dry cleaners? Uh, yeah, okay. Sure. Right. You didn't tell anyone, did you? Like, oh, Richard's done a mm, wine No, yeah. no, no, I didn't. All right, cool. How was the business trip for you, apart from that? Uh, it was great. It was great to see those speeches and things. Oh, I think this is us it. talking about how that one, oh, okay. the the thing where we were slightly flirty went. Okay. I can't tell. Maybe it's something else. Well, we can ask if she is single. We can use referencing the business trip mm. to find out if she is single. That okay. seems like the galaxy brain. Oh, yeah. We can ask if she liked any men at the event and tell her why they are useless. We don't want to exert the power too often. I mean, is that exerting power or is that demonstrating knowledge? And which is the good one again? Okay, that that one might be too complicated for us. I don't know. We can say she needs to add me on Facebook as company policy. Face, every you, I have so many people on Facebook and only two of them have had my dick in them. Yeah, me too. And I've got three people on Facebook. So that's only two thirds. That's, that's not damn. I need a hundred percent success rate. Yeah. Uh, I need to know how much are those three likes on Facebook worth? I don't. They're worthless. Yeah. Let's let's choose B. We were away for a few days. You know, is that okay with with everything? Like, yeah, it's okay. You don't have cats to feed. No, or I don't. Boyfriend didn't miss you too much. I don't have a boyfriend. You don't? Okay, great. So, um, I can invite you on even longer trips, right? Like, if we <gasps> go to different yeah, conferences sure. and different. Okay, countries. so as long okay, as you, um, what she's getting from this, as long as she continues to not have a boyfriend. She will get more and greater business That's opportunities. Cool. Nice yes, uh, planting those seeds. Mm -hmm. uh, your your dating life is is directly opposed to opportunities. As long as you're dating anyone yeah, but definitely. me. I mean, if you were dating Correct. me, then those business opportunities would be one to one. Right, quid pro quo. And yeah. Yeah. So just you know, QED. Just think about that. Just mull it over. Sarah, can you come in? Roll it around in your mouth. See how it feels. Richard, do you need anything? Appreciate the smell. Yeah, yep. I just wanted to share the, the good news. Have you seen the Wall Street Journal today? The blue. No. <laughs> oh, that's brilliant. Those short it has notes. It has yeah, hints, oh, notes. hints of papyrus. Yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah. Of, of Elder Scrolls. Of over a billion. <laughs> Everyone's redeeming their funds, taking money out. He's in big trouble now. Everything's brilliant. Congratulations. Yeah, we need to do something to celebrate. Okay. Mm can take credit and tell her to book me a spa day. I mean, that sounds great for me. It sounds less great for my penis getting inside her. Mm -hmm. Smack her on the ass and thank her for her support. 
we haven't. I think that's a little forward. I think the the smacking on the ass is afterward. Is after we is as a post coital maneuver. Oh, see, I was gonna say the opposite. Oh, you think so? Uh, yeah, I think smacking her on the ass is good, uh, but thanking her afterwards—that's just redundant. <laughs> oh, the, yeah. The smack on the ass that's, is thanks enough. Yes, it is. This is just—that's not smacking her on the ass anymore. It's kissing it, and that's mm, that's not what she's about. about. I didn't even think about that. We can tell her you are not finished with those cocksuckers. Or you can give her $1,000 and tell her to buy some fancy snacks and wine for everyone. That. Yeah, everyone can enjoy fancy snacks and wine. That's a power play. Keeps the doors open. Shows that we aren't singling out her. But we really are. I mean, we really are. But look, if this turns into an office-wide date. Ooh, I didn't even think about that. See, that's that's that galaxy brain shit. Three man, moves ahead. This is, this, is, this is why you're the boss, man. Yep. That's why I spent a thousand dollars on fancy snacks and wine for everyone yesterday. I can't believe that's where it's going. Yep. Thanks, uh, everyone on Patreon. Yep. Uh, uh, probate. Uh, <laughs> I know what we can do. We but called it probate day. Oh, shit. nice. Take this cash. Grab I don't know yeah, how much is there. I'm not good with there. money or numbers. <laughs> it's just that's some, woman's uh, work. <laughs> for Friday, get some booze, some nice food, sushi or something. What else can we do? Just little gifts for different people, right? Okay. Spend every penny. Good idea. Look, every nice penny. As well. If I see mm. one penny unspent, you are going to get such a smack on the ass. <laughs> uh, cool, nice one, right? Option, you know, it's good to show the love, be generous, and yeah, it's one of those cases where uh, people will respect you more if you credit the other people. Even if you. <laughs> Look at that action. smile! <laughs> Yeah, and it's also nice to show that you're generous and that I would like to commemorate Miss Earrings for never visibly rolling her eyes. Yeah. Richard? Ooh, I like, I like the dress she's wearing. Oh, great. Thank you. Yeah, um, Galaxy brain. It looks like a dress, but it's pants. Ooh, it's beautiful like and professional <laughs> like <laughs> us. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I completely... More informal. I yep. think we're at that stage. Yep, yeah, I think it's time. I mean, I... It's a coin flip between that and sleazy, but <laughs> any given day of the week. <laughs> <laughs> but today being Tuesday, Tuesday at the time of this recording, that's more informal day. More informal oh. Tuesday, we call okay. it. Yeah, you know what, Sarah? I was really stressed, and I'm sorry if I was a bit sharp with you at times or anything like that. You know, it happens. But now we're in a good time, so all is well. And... I think you bring this calm to the office, and it oh, definitely helps so the atmosphere. It's so nice to hear that. Yeah, you have a great energy. Thank you. Excellent. <laughs> Thank you. Well done. Sarah, you know what? <gasps> what? <gasps> oh, okay. Uh, we can coolly invite her on a date. Now, this whole time I was thinking she was a speed freak. Mm -hmm, but but when, when we complimented her on her calm, mm -hmm. she was into that too. So maybe... Maybe it, she's uh, mm. an ACDC, you know, she can go both ways. I, I she might uh, she might like being able to stay stay calm under the pressure. Mhm. Mm she she likes uh staying home, but she also likes going out. Yeah. That's my favorite thing to see on a dating profile. You don't mm. see that often, but when you do, you know. Mhm. Mm oh yeah. Yeah. But we could also tell her it's time to add some new responsibilities to her job, uh undo belt. That I, I think that's a little, that's a good move, but I don't know if that's right now. I, I think the problem with that is that asking her to dress and undress you uh, infantilizes you. You don't want her thinking of herself as your mother. I you, didn't even think about that. Uh, or we could push her against the wall and kiss her. Now that's, that's always an attractive move, but you know what? When, when it's time, when it's really time, mm -hmm. she'll push herself back up against the wall. That's how dominant you are. You don't even oh. need to do anything. She does it for you. We are the boss. We are the boss. And being the boss means getting what you need before you even ask for it. That's right. Let's coolly invite her on a date. You've been working here for a while. You've been working here for a while. And, you know, we get on well professionally, but I hope you don't mind me saying, but I think we get on well personally as well. Mm, yeah. Yeah. So this is a little bit delicate, and I hope it's okay, but um, I was thinking 
And you can say no if you want, no problem. But I was thinking maybe one day we could go out on a date. Oh! Um, yeah, why not? Okay, great. And we don't need to tell anyone about it. It's just between us. Okay. Oh no, she's in the chair. Well done. It ah, she's a, she best, has assumed the dominant work, position. So, well done. So how's it going with Mr. Larina? I really expected. So how's it going with Mr. Larina? I really expected Good you guys to get it on. No, it's just professional. Oh. Okay. Oh no. Okay, Casanova. Uh, I like this one too. Do you like it? <laughs> Give me the computer again. Give on him Steam. A computer oh, okay. Game. That's just the. Oh, okay. Uh, that's all that's right. all right. All right. Correct so, choices. So Casanova, a, a famous C plus well, student in the well, seduction well, arts. Gift, yeah. Uh, you know, it's a good starting place. Obviously, like there's it. there's mm. better we could have done. <laughs> yeah. But I mean, seventy one seventy one point four three percent. I mean, that's a C minus, really. Okay. That's a what passing grade, but that's true. You gift it this holiday season. C's, C's get degrees. Game, you gift it this holiday and uh huh, uh huh. Degrees get get hotter in Celsius, uh -huh. which is also a C. So the more degrees you have, yep, the more hot you are. Yes. We, well, that's not her job. Surely. And when you bring that back down from like, cause so, so a seventy eight percent, that's a C plus, that's lots more Cs. Yes. But when you can bring it down to a seventy one and coolly ask her out, ah, see, you've got to have that that control. Fluctuation. Yeah. The AC and the DC. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. Kieran. I've now reached that magical point yeah. uh -huh. when I'm no longer sure if I'm being ironic or not. I I know one. it's like it just kind of it just happens naturally, yeah, and I don't even um, think about again, it like <laughs> until so, you know, until I acknowledge it, and then it all comes crashing down, down, and yeah. it's terrible. I can't well. wait uh, yeah, for Super Seducer goal. Three, it's where he gives us a shout out and then nukes us. Yep. I hope that happens, uh, and then we can finally have our man-on-man man dating. That's all I want. Uh, yep. Uh, 301 a level uh, shit. We'll get Scott in here. We'll we'll do it up. Well, no, we'll get Scott afterward. Right. Because we're going to test it on him. And we'll know it works afterward. Right? Yeah, and again, he's acting professionally. I mean, you know, you is, is it right for the test to be on easy mode? <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Damn indeed. Thank you for joining me, Kieran. <laughs> of course. I wanted to do this so bad. <laughs> me too. <laughs> Let us know in the comments if you like this horse shit, because there's... We got the whole game right here. There's more to be done yes. if we feel like it. That I know. If you guys want us to do... I will play this whole fucking game. I'm not even kidding. I love this shit. This is my jam. Okay, well, should, should we flip the script then? Tell us in the comments if you don't want us to do this, and then we'll ignore you. Because we're doing it whether you like it or not. That's dominance. Now they have to date us. Okay. Good stuff. Bye. Uh, 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 uh,